Hello and welcome or welcome back. For today's video, we have an affordable fall clothing haul. Excuse this weird angle. I know with clothing hauls, I usually like sit down, talk about the clothes and then cut to the try on and then blah, blah, blah. But I didn't feel like sitting and setting up. I'd rather just be standing the whole time instead of having to do a bunch of back and forth. So in a second, I'll fix the angle. But for now you have this. And you guys, this is actually the first haul in the newly painted room. First haul where the background is this color. If you're new here, and you don't know what I'm talking about, I recently explained in the room decor haul that I redid my room. You can go check that out. Anyway, clothing haul. Today we're doing an affordable fall clothing haul. And I know usually with my clothing hauls, I obviously put like the name of the store or whatever that I got the clothes from. But this time it's kind of different because it's actually from two places keeping it affordable. I went to Ross and I went to Fashion Q or something. Does everyone know what that is? All the malls that I've gone to always have like some sort of cheapy Q store. And I've seen so many of these stores, so many versions of these stores, like Q, Q Love, Fashion Q, like do you know what I'm talking about? Here, let me show you the back. So it has like this queue. Even some of the malls that I've been to have like two or more of these kinds of stores where it's like they always have this queue. Anyway, affordable clothes from Ross and Fashion Q. And I'm gonna call this a fall haul because it's fall time, fall season, even though it doesn't necessarily feel like fall, like it's still kind of hot. We still get hot days. I just don't know what else to call this haul. So without further ado, Let's get started. Okay, so I've decided we're gonna do Ross first because there's not as much from there. So first top from Ross, we have this cute little cropped orangey top. And I was like, you know, this is very fall, fall vibes, fall colors. It has this little ruching here. I actually did wear this once already. That's why the tag's not on it. So I don't remember the price, sorry, but it's cute. And obviously it's Ross, so it wasn't that expensive. Anyway, okay, I took my hair down because it did not want to stay up, but this is the orangey top. And again, cute fall color. Again, she a little cropped but that's okay definitely worth the price in my opinion the only thing that's a little annoying is these little ties at the bottom untie all the time like they always just come apart so that's the only thing that bothers me but it's cute i think it's a cute top so yeah i like it a lot nothing super wrong with it except that these things come loose a lot so i'm gonna give this top like an eight out of ten Next up from Ross, I have this like round, I don't know, tank top, but it's like not spaghetti straps. It's like thick on the shoulders. I don't even know what I would call this, but it's a brown top. <laughs> Again, fall colors, fall vibes. Brown is very in nowadays. And this is like a cute top, very different for me. But yeah, this was $7.99. So, you know, good deal, good deal. Um, Yeah, let's try it on. Okay, this brown top, I have some mixed feelings about. Obviously, I bought it, so I didn't hate it. But when I tried these on in Ross, I literally tried it on in five minutes because I didn't want to be trying on clothes and in the store for too long because coronavirus. So I just quickly put it on. I'm like, hey, it fits, let's go. But I didn't get too good of a look at it, clearly. So this is her. Oh, and I put my hair up because I feel like with my hair down, it just looks even weirder. So this top obviously has like this thick shoulder wide shoulder situation happening and it's very high neck, which is very different for me. So you know what? I'm pushing myself out of my comfort zone a little bit. I thought it was cute. Like in the store, it seemed fine. I'm like, oh, this is a cute little detail. The whatever is happening here. Um, but looking at it now, I don't know how I feel about it. Like, I don't know what I could do to make it look cuter but it's not ugly like i like it but then i don't but then i do i don't know if i need maybe some jewelry or something and dress it up i don't know how do we feel about this top i like it because fall vibes and it's brown and it's something different for me so yeah i don't know i don't know how i feel about this top i'm sure on anyone else it would look very cute i'm still i'm trying to figure out how i feel about it i don't know it's not bad because I feel like this is very trendy and something a lot of people nowadays would wear. But like maybe the current fashion trends aren't for me. I don't know. I don't hate it, but I don't love it. So for those reasons, I'm gonna give her a seven and a half out of 10. Okay, and third and final thing from Ross, we have this 
sweater, cute little navy blue sweater with some white stars and it has this like little fraying. Very fall vibes because it's a sweater. Probably not gonna be wearing this anytime soon because it's still too hot for sweaters. But when I bought this, I was preparing, you know? And this was actually $12.99. It's a little more, but again, for a sweater, this is way cheaper than like $40 at American Eagle or something. No shade to American Eagle. We love American Eagle. I only shop there though when there's like sales or I have a gift card. Anyway. Okay, here we have the sweater. I love this a lot. This is actually in a size large. I could have gotten a medium. Obviously it's a little loose, it's a little big, but at the same time, I like my clothes loose and big, especially like sweaters, especially since this is already cropped. Like I think it sits well with size large the little frame everywhere. I just noticed that it's actually on the sleeves too and then up here and then down here. So it's very distressed, but that's okay. Anyway, I think it's very cute. I love it a lot. Good quality and worth the price. So I'm gonna give this sweater, because there's literally nothing wrong with it. I'm gonna give this sweater a 10 out of 10. Now moving on to the Fashion Q clothes. Again, it's such a random store, but if you really look, they have nice things there. So first things first from Fashion Q, I have this little cropped black and white striped tank top. This was $6.99. So I'm gonna be honest with you here, the little straps, obviously not the most supportive or thickest material, but whatever okay this first top from that q store very much the opposite of that sweater not as fall vibes very much summer vibes it's a freaking tank top very cropped for me personally this is out of my comfort zone in the sense that it's it's very cropped maybe my pants just aren't high-waisted enough but like this is very cropped and this top I think is in a size large, so that's that. I mean, it's cute if I just stay still and don't move. So I'll give this top a seven out of 10. Next, we have this, I don't know what to call this pattern, but like pattern brown and black crop top. I'm gonna say fall vibes because it's brown. Not bad material, thin little straps, but you know, it's fine. You get what you pay for because this top, original price for this, it's $6.99, but it wasn't even $6.99. This was also in the clearance section and I got her for $3.99. So again, I'm not mad at it. I think it's cute. Okay, so this brown top, I like a lot. She's also in the size large. She's stretchy. She's a little thicker than that last top. So I like that. Obviously from far away, it just looks like a normal strap, which it is. But if you want to look, there's like a little detailing here. Again, very simple, cute. I don't really know what else to say. Again, this top is brown, so I feel like it's very trendy because brown is very in right now, which I like. I think it's actually very cute. Also, this pattern, I feel like is a very trendy pattern. I'm liking that brown is having a moment because I feel like before no one really wore brown, including me. Like I didn't own brown clothes. The only thing in my closet that I have that's brown is my graduation gown. Anyway, this is very cute. I like the top. Nothing's wrong with it. It fits well. Again, it's large. The sizing is a little weird, but this one isn't as cropped as the last top. So I definitely feel more comfortable wearing this one. So I'm gonna rate it a 10 out of 10. Okay, next top. I actually really like this one. I feel like it's nicer, a little bit more dressy in a sense, but I don't know if you could tell how it's supposed to go by just holding it up like this. It kind of like folds over and ties in the front. It's really cropped. It looks really cropped because you're supposed to tie it in the front, but I think I plan on styling it a little different. We'll see what happens when I try it on. This top was, again, clearance section. Like, the store is already <laughs> pretty cheap, and I went the extra mile to look into the clearance section. Anyway, original price is $9.99, but I got her for $5.99. So yeah, let's go try it on. Okay, so here we have the blue top and I actually tied it differently. It's supposed to like tie in the front like the little bow thing. But when I tied it that way, it was just a little too cropped. It's already pretty cropped. Like I'm popping out of this a lot to avoid being super extra cropped. I tied it in the back over here. 
so there's that but i think it's very cute hopefully one day i feel confident enough to wear it out and about maybe i'll find myself some like extra high-waisted jeans or something this top realistically i don't know when i'll wear it but i like it a lot so for those very confusing reasons i'm gonna give this top a 10 out of 10. okay and final top for this haul i have this cute little sagey green army green spaghetti strap crop top situation crosses in the back you can't really tell while i'm holding it up but you'll see when i try it on but very cute and it's actually a very nice material i don't know if you can tell super stretchy and thick like i feel like for a cheapy store like this is nice quality nice material i don't know what this material is but it's very soft do you know what i mean i think it's a very nice material compared to like the other tank tops this one's really nice and again cute color i love the green clearly i'm wearing green so i say fall vines because this like green color i feel like is very in in general and then i feel like this color is perfect for fall anyway this top i got her for four ninety. Okay, really quickly before I start talking about this top, the blue top that I just tried on, that was in a size medium. I know the first two tank tops were large. Just saying that because I think I forgot to say it earlier. Yeah. Anyway, now onto this green top. This one is actually also in a size medium. So again, the store sizing is weird. The first two tops were large. These last two were medium. So I don't know. This top though is actually very stretchy. So there's that. I really like this top. I really like this color. I think this type of green is just very nice neutral basic color to have and goes well with fall it's a nice little basic solid color tank top that i could just put a cardigan over or sweater or flannel or literally anything so again a nice little basic to have in the closet she does cross in the back so there's that nice little detail not that anyone's really gonna see it because i'm probably gonna wear this with a cardigan or flannel or sweater anyway but yeah the top is very nice i have no complaints she's very cute very soft simple basic comfy i love it so i'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. and last but not least the final item of this haul this cute little brown cropped jacket thingy but nice material i don't know fashion i don't know materials but i think it's good quality for again one of these quote unquote cheapy stores you find some nice stuff in these stores anyway this jacket was $16.99 so a little bit more than the rest of the stuff in this haul but again a jacket like this and like a higher end store would be way more than $16.99. So I think this is a steal for a cute little brown jacket. And again, it's brown, brown vibes, the brown is in, brown is fall. So yeah, here's the jacket. I literally love it so much. It's just so cute. My hair is literally hiding in the back. But you know what? We should keep my hair hiding in the back because this jacket deserves a moment. So you know what? We'll keep my hair back there. You guys, this jacket I love so freaking much. <laughs> she is in a size large, which is why she's a little oversized looking. If it were up to me, I probably would have gotten the medium, but this was literally the only size I found. Like I could not find any more of this jacket. So of course I saw it and I was like, I'm freaking taking this. I'd rather have that oversized look than like too tight and too small. She's big, obviously. My hands don't even pop out when I'm standing, but I don't care. It's cute. I'm very fall and just, I don't know. I love it so much. And then the back, not that much going on, but it's still cute. Like it's casual, but also like nice. You know what I mean? It's just so cute. It's just so cute and very fall vibes in my opinion. Again, the brown, I don't own brown. Now I do own a lot of brown. Yeah, I don't know, I just really, I just really freaking like this jacket. So, honestly, this is, this is my favorite item from this haul. I don't know when I'm gonna wear it, but I literally love it so freaking much. Like, I just feel so much better in this. <laughs> so, this is more than a 10. This is a freaking 11 out of 10. Anyway, that's that. Okay, you guys, that is that for this affordable fall clothing haul. I'm literally still wearing what I was just wearing because I'm too lazy to take it off and very cute and comfy. Anyway, this clothing haul, I think it was a success. I liked everything I got. Definitely worth all the prices. Ross, this fashion queue. And also, I don't know if I mentioned this earlier, this fashion queue store, there was no fitting room. So I literally bought this stuff hoping that it would fit me and that I would like it and I just took it. <laughs> and in the end, I pretty much liked all my stuff. So 
yeah i enjoyed this haul hopefully you enjoyed this haul if you did please give this video a thumbs up and if you're new subscribe for future videos and hauls and things like that and comment down below what your favorite item was from this haul me personally i'm thinking this jacket but there was a lot of good stuff so you let me know what you liked because why not anyway that is that for this video see y'all next time and yeah Bye.